Welcome back to beautiful Portland, Oregon and Glendevere for the final round of the Portland Open presented by Dynamic Discs. Sitting with an eight-stroke lead, Valerie Mondohano, who is looking to put her stamp on the disc golf world with her second Elite Series win of the year. Can she bring it home? You'll find out live on the Disc Golf Network. Pierce, the birdie look on four. There she goes. Take a big throw to get there. Rebecca has slid back to fifth. Needs to get it going here. And the Ooh. disc is trying to Look come back, thing. and it manages. That was awesome. Great opportunity for Rebecca. This will be back to back for Katrina. And move her within eight. This is much more like we thought we'd be seeing Yesterday. Katrina Allen attack this course. Manduhano. She'll need to navigate around that leaning tree. Beautifully done. Fantastic. Back to back birdies for your leader coming up so you don't know how hard to throw it from the other side of the fairway on eight we've got Gannon seems like an easier approach in for a right hand backhand oh you know? yes it was she's demonstrated <laughs> yeah, how she... easy it is it's just like that yeah just throw a hyzer at it well looking at the the ground there which didn't have much grass I think that would have been dangerous Paige Pierce with a great putt. Speaking of dangerous, this woman is uh, uh -huh. looking to be a little bit dangerous today. Crawling up the scoreboard shot by shot. Pearson? Oh, yeah. So it's backhanding a yeah. disc upside down rather than forehanding it upside down. Kind of? You still have a regular grip, but it just rolls with. Oh, my goodness. Scoggins. Excuse us. Was she putting while we were talking? She was from 60 feet. <laughs> Nailed it. What a smash on a 615 foot hole. Wow. Ryan's second on nine. Oh my goodness. That was inches away from banging some chain. She's going right down the middle. Look at the turn on this. Oh, off the band? Right? I, I didn't Let's, hear we, it. We'll get a replay. I saw it like a little change well, in, in ac action, yeah. I was kind of impressed that the disc flipped up when she was, released it. I'm I like, oh, too. it's downhill, it's going to go left. But I, right I, I should have not discounted her ability to throw. Rolling back to Zuka replay. Yeah, look at it. Stand up. She loves her flippy shots. Oh, yes, yeah. you were right. Wow, just a little tink off the band. What a bid from Manu Hano. You cannot have a supporting point forward. Oh. Corber on 11. Oh, and that nestles that in the wood beautiful. chips. That looks to be a safer look at it. She got it farther forward. Oh, that's a birdie. So that wow. Hanu. Five of the last six once that drops in. Ella Hansen. That was a birdie look on 12. Gorgeous step through putt. Maria Oliva, T of 13. Over to 12. Cox coming off the birdie on 11. She's been throwing that disc so well all weekend. Gives it some Anheuser angle, and it has a very reliable hyzer or fade back at the end. And if it didn't, it wouldn't land very far by. Truth back to Rebecca Cox coming off back-to-back -back birdies we're on hole 13 
Woo! Almost Maria Olivia that right there. Ooh, she sure did. Gosh, that was close. Back to 15. Ganon, a birdie look. What a fantastic putt. Between the trees, had to give it some hyzer angle. A circle two making a turkey for Gannon. She is moving up to the boards into a tie for fifth with Pierce. Back to 17. Scoggins throwing two. She is short of the woods. However, it looks like she's lined up in the biggest gap. So great positioning. This is 550 feet. Again, it always seems it's like it's slightly uphill, playing longer. 270 in for Own. So very reachable. She left that a bit low, but it has oh. a nice skip on it. Great time for a great shot for Own, as Cat just tied her. Mondu Hano, birdie look. To get to 21 under par. Piece of cake. The lead is 11 for the moment. Oh, Corver barely in bounds. Now throws Slow three. Slow down. Slow down. Go in. Go in. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it went from a slow down to a go in. That's fun. And your 2022 Portland Open champion, Valerie Mondujano.